good morning guys so today our topic is maintain fiscal year variant under SAP so first of all we will see the path and then we will perform it so it is IMG IMG means implementation guide screen we will go there by SPRO then financial accounting then financial accounting global settings then fiscal year and then maintain fiscal year variant so let's perform this under SAP so we will go by SPRO SAP reference IMG financial accounting financial accounting global settings fiscal year and then maintain fiscal year variant Let's come back and study it. You can define the following characteristics for a fiscal year variant in SAP. How many posting periods a fiscal year has? Like normally we are having a 12 months period. How many special periods you need? Special periods means like for example your audit is going to be started. So you can keep either one, two or three or four special periods. But SAP is recommending you to keep four special periods how the system is to determine the posting periods when you posting for example if you are posting in a special period your audit gets started and your order for example is getting started in january or february month and it is going till april month so you can post all those entries in the special periods when defining your fiscal year you have the following options your fiscal year is either the calendar year in this case you must only select the calendar year field or your fiscal is not the same as the calendar year and is not a year dependent or maybe it is a year dependent so let's see this so this is where we have to define our fiscal year variant so what SAP says for a calendar year which is January to December SAP says K4 will be your fiscal year variant if it is present because we are using IDES, so it is already present in it. Otherwise, you can go by new entries and perform or maintain in the same way. So K4 calendar year with four special periods. Year dependent, as I said, year dependent can be if your fiscal year is starting other than the January month. For example, in India, it is April to March, Pakistan, July to June. So in those cases, you have to select here year dependent. But here in this case, we are choosing calendar year. Calendar year is January to December. For example, like USA and also UAE, we are using calendar year, January to December. Number of posting periods. Number of posting periods are your months in a fiscal year. So usually we have 12 months, January to December or whatever you choose your fiscal year. So in one year we are having 12 months and we are keeping 4 months as a special periods. But this 4 is not dependent on the months. Like it does not mean like January 2022 till April 2022. Okay. For example if you are finding out any entry related to your auditors who, who sort out in your audit and it is in the month of May or June you can still keep and posting this entry into the fourth special period okay so this is if you are having a calendar year now let's talk about the year dependent for example i will go into a year dependent field this is a year dependent field let's discuss this one so here what do we say we are having in this first column 1 till 12 are posting periods okay one we say 31 and then period is 10th and then year shift minus one it can be understand better because here we say this is our first period okay so first period we are saying is april here it is 4, 4th means April, here it is days, April has 30 days, but in my fiscal year it will be the first period. 
and I will be making it a year shift 0 for example I am talking about 2021 so year shift will be 0 then this one is 5 5 means my my has 31 days and period is second in my fiscal year if I am starting from April to March so my, my will be my second period and year shift 0 because we are talking about 2021 same way this will be my June July 31 August 31 September 30 October 31 November 30 December 31 then we are coming here here is January 31 days but in my fiscal year it will be my 10th period and year shift will be minus 1 because we will be here in 2022 but our fiscal year will be 2021 that is why we will be doing minus 1 so same here is February and March 31 days year shift minus 1 let's talk about period text so in the first column we are talking about our language English as I said in the previous periods 1 is APR April 2 is my 3 is June 4 July 5 August 6 September 7 October 8 November 9 December 10 January 11 February 12 March and then look about this 13 is SP1 special period 1 14 is SP2 special period 2 for audit periods 15 SP3 special period 3 for audit and 16 SP4 special period 4 so when your year will be closed your auditors will come and if they found out any entry so no need to close your previous year you just put your entry with sp1 in the period sp2 sp3 or sp4 and meanwhile you can also do working in the current year which will be your 2022 period so guys this is all about maintain fiscal year variant so if you have any questions regarding the fiscal year variant or any other topic related to SAP FICO you can post in the comments and surely I will be making any video or I will be answering you. Thank you so much. Bye.